Welcome to the very first video of our fitness journey. This is really exciting, isn't it? I'm freezing. <laughs> I'm freezing. I know we're filming um, in a living room really quick. And uh, well, Cara, you're okay because you're wearing pants, but I'm wearing. <laughs> oh my crap! You go. I'm I'm wearing, I'm wearing shorts. <laughs> oh yeah! Don't do like, like don't film this. <laughs> <Thank look. you. laughs> Let's look at that. Pay attention. No, don't. In our previous video, we mentioned that we would work towards our individual goals. Uh, they're very different, so it's probably worth checking out that video so you can kind of get an idea of what we're both looking to achieve. But we thought we would do this video. This is a a before sort of shot for you. We're going to do weekly updates as we mentioned in our other video as well. I've got some things that I want to do as far as sh showing you. So I'm wearing shorts and Kara's wearing tights uh, because obviously <laughs> we've chosen our outfits to uh, show you, to emphasize our flaws, yeah. to show our our goal area, well, not, goal, not yeah. goal areas, our problem areas. Yeah, and not emphasize, but highlight. Like emphasize, I guess, is like yeah, maybe yeah, not make them work, look not make worse them look than worse. they are, but show as much well. of them as, <laughs> as we, show them well. That's good. Yes. <laughs> mm. So that's the idea behind wearing shorts and pants and choosing different outfits. So we're gonna do some measurements and get sorry, Cara, I feel like I'm chopping you. That's I'm, only because I'm six foot tall. <laughs> 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 Do it, measure me, like not measure me. <laughs> Stand up normally to me. Ready? <laughs> Are you normal? <laughs> yes, I'm normal. <laughs> People would beg to differ, but I, I am normal. I wet myself. <laughs> 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 I think I just beat I'm warm now. <laughs> Okay, so measurements, like as far as like <laughs> circumferences and things like that, and scales, and just an overall body shot, sort of like yeah. the problem. Well, we just everything. We're just gonna try and give you a holistic idea. <laughs> Sorry. I'd like to be in this one. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I feel like you should be holding the camera. I was, and you took it away from me. Take <laughs> the camera. Oh, that's my control issues. <laughs> so we just. Get to it? Yeah. <laughs> that was a solid yes. <laughs> Actually, before I start measuring, let's just quickly, I'll just show the problem areas. All right, so come in. Oh. <laughs> No, so um, my belly is not a huge problem area for me. Um, it's not uh, by any means where I want it to be, but uh, it's not the worst thing that I'm focused. <laughs> it's not the worst. You know, thing. it's going to come together very quickly once you give yes. it some attention. Once I actually yes. start working out, I'm sure it will just come, you know, come around. But um, really, what? So I mean, have a look anyway. So this is kind of what I'm dealing with. Got a bit of loose skin from after having Wesley and don't pay attention to my battle wounds from some surgery I had when I was pregnant but that's it right that's my that's my stomach so I won't focus on that too much but I will do measurements of that still also my legs okay so my legs are my problem area they are what I'm focusing on so if you've got problem if your problem area is your legs then follow my journey because hopefully you'll enjoy it <laughs> I don't know why I said hopefully you'll enjoy it. <laughs> Kara's too busy laughing, I had to take the camera back. <laughs> no, follow my journey because hopefully it will give you... Some Stop it! <laughs> hopefully it will give you some inspiration to help you achieve what you want to achieve as well. Like I said, if it's your pro same problem area. Now take the camera back. I'm going to do my measurements. Now I'm going to start with my legs and you'll have to do my arms, Cara. Mm -hmm. But uh, let's let's do the legs first. Okay. Alright, so I'm going to do the thickest part, which is here. See this? Oh, chunky. Alright, so. Alright, D3. 50, whoa. 53 centimetres. Okay, 53 centimetres for my upper thigh and my knee, because that's the other problem area. Trying to get the widest part here is 29 mm -hmm. and 33, mm -hmm. the widest part here, and just my ankle, 22. Now, uh, waist. <laughs> Woo! Ooh, Wesley James. Okay, so around my belly button, it doesn't even reach. So, how, how long is the tape? 64. So we can't measure, have a quick look. 
We are unable to measure all the way around because I don't have a long enough tape measure, but we can get an idea that this is 64 centimeters, right? From there to there. I'll try and keep my fingers there. There, all right? Extra 12. Is it 12 or is it on the other side? Turn it over. No, it's 12. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. So, so 64, 64 plus 12. Plus 12. <laughs> All right, cool. So 76. Ooh, girl. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? I want to do the widest part of me too because my, oh, that was the other thing I was going to mention, my butt. Okay, so since having Wesley, I just broke the tape measure. <laughs> Good thing I don't need it. <laughs> <laughs> since having Wesley, I've been sitting down a lot. Breastfeeding has consumed my life sitting down for hours on end. So now my butt has gone completely flat, like there's nothing there. It's like flat. It used to be like up here, <laughs> nice and lump and plump, um, but now it's not. So that's another thing I want to work on, getting my butt lifted. But I won't measure it because, I mean. <laughs> <laughs> so the last thing is, I think my arms, right? That's the last problem area I mm -hmm. said. I can do it. Or even if I hold it and you pull it or something. That's all right, I got it. You keep letting it drop. I do. Let me hold it. <laughs> 28. Mm -hmm. That's it. That's, it. that's you done. That's me done. So I just really want to gain weight in a healthy way all over. I want to strengthen my tummy muscles. I'm pretty happy with the size and shape and everything, but I just know that there's no strength there. And I am very aware that I let my stomach muscles go relaxed a lot of the time, which gives me the impression that I have like a pot tummy when really I don't. If I had stronger core, I would have a much flatter stomach. Oh, everyone's going, oh, you poor thing. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up for Cry a time. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to get hate messages. <laughs> With that skinny bitch, shut up. Um, but yeah, we all have our own problem areas. We do. That's and especially right. when you want to be fit and healthy and strong and you know that you are underweight and you are aware of that. I think it's a good thing to be self-aware and to yeah take it into your own hands and feel better about yourself. So none of us are perfect and we all want to improve ourselves and this is how I want to improve myself. So I guess really, yeah, just overall weight gain. Okay, so we've decided to give the measuring a miss. Oh. What we're going to do is we're going to just have a close look at how my body looks. And then once it's toned up and it looks bigger, we'll be able to see the difference from the before and after. Yeah, and you'll be able to get it in the weight, like the scales as well. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Considering I'm not going for a set amount of weight or a set amount of centimeters in circumference or anything like that it's a bit of a moot point so like a whole approach like a whole body approach really yeah. so yours is the just gaining weight and muscle i guess in general which will almost be a byproduct of eating more food and working out regularly yeah i figured that's just going to happen naturally if i do those two things and oh we'll soon find really, out <laughs> well, yeah we will find out so i'm really focusing on strengthening my core improving my posture and then just building my legs a little bit toning my thighs and but this is the only place I have any meat. <laughs> so soft to sit on. <laughs> Turn around, give us a view. Oh yes. The peach. So it needs a little lift, but again, that'll happen once I start being active. And I wouldn't mind building some more definition in my legs because they're quite slim. Let's just get a whole good idea. Stand completely normal. Oh, <laughs> that's Cara's that's normal. That's how I stand. That's Cara's completely normal. <laughs> So while Dan goes to change Wesley's nappy, I'm going to show you my weight on the scales and then when she pops back, she's going to do hers. I am currently at a, but that's 56.8 kg, usually around the 54 to 56 kilo mark which is not fabulous for someone of my height i'm nearly 5'11 anyone can see from any of our other videos i am quite slim and if you're going to go by bmi i'm underweight like not even by a small percentage i'm underweight i don't live by those kind of percentages too much if i feel fit and healthy and strong and i know i'm eating well i've just lived 
like this but I do know that I could increase my strength and tone my muscles and in turn that's going to make me look fitter and stronger and healthier so that's my goal we'll see how Dan is getting on with the old nappy change let's have a look hello is it stinky in there it's so stinky don't come in <laughs> Okay, it's my turn now, so I'm going to weigh myself because I haven't done that yet. Let's have a look at what the scales say. Okie dokie, 52.7. 52.7, Cara. I still weigh more than you. <laughs> well, you should do because you're a lot taller than me. I, I expected we would be about the same weight. Well, that's not good though. I mean, oh, because you're trying to gain. Okay, yeah. No, 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 just because like you're shorter, but if you were my height, maybe we'd weigh the same. Just veto that. That's great! <laughs> <laughs> mm. so, hi everyone, I want my milk! I just want my milk, hurry up and finish the video y'all! <laughs> So that's our measurements and our weighing all done. That gives you an idea of where we're starting and we're going to do weekly updates with our progress and daily snippets on Instagram like we said. And we'll do when we do our weigh-ins, we'll try and make sure we're wearing the same thing every time just so you can get an accurate perspective. Good idea. Yeah. But for now, that's it. So we will see you next week for our next up well not next our first update yes weigh in remeasure all that stuff cool see you then see you there